Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to Damien Doran's Infamous Collectibles channel. Today's video, as promised last Tuesday's video, today's video is going to be a shoe review. Yeah. <laughs> the reason I'm reviewing these shoes is because Vans a few weeks ago just announced that they were doing their collaboration with Marvel and I was super anticipated to just see what kind of shoes that they were going to make and I was browsing their selection and I found these and I just had to jump on them because I loved the way they looked in their pictures and I really wanted to see the way they looked in person so I ordered them and now they're here. So let's get into the shoes and see which ones I got. I mean I know which ones I got but for the person watching first off thank you for for clicking on this video. Second y'all don't know what's in this box so without talking y'all's ears off let's just jump right in and see what shoes I got. All right, got the outside of the box here with the Vans tape. I always love that. Yeah, I love that they have this Vans tape. I don't know. I'm not actually reviewing the tape. It just looks awesome and I love <laughs> I love that they use it is what I'm saying. That's the whole point. But let's open this bad boy up. Oh, shoot, boy. All right, well, I guess this is the bottom of the box. It's uh, It was packaged upside down. Or maybe I just opened it upside down. I don't know. I didn't look. Cool. Dude, hell yes. I love the way this box looks. Check that out. Move that box out of the way. Get out of my frame box. Holy sh**. Alright, so we have the actual shoe box here. Right here on the front, or on the top I should say, you have Marvel Vans. And you have all these little panels from comics, which I think that looks badass. And here you can see it a little bit on the front as well. Then here off to the side, again you get the Marvel Vans. More, more panels from comics. On the other side, again, you have, well, you have the sticker here that has your shoe size on it, and you have Marble Vans again. Yeah, and then on the bottom of the box, as you saw when I opened it, you have all the shoe sizes. Yeah, so that's awesome. All right, so now to open this box. Whoo! The anticipation continues. Whoo! Oh, man. They look way better in person. Hey, let me get these boys out so we can take a closer look at them. All right. Damn. Hell yeah, it loves. Actually, let's jump over to the table so we can take a closer look at them because I, I'm not liking this setup. It's it's a little weird to me now. Whoo! All right, welcome to the white table. It's not what the official name of this table is, but you know, it is a white table. Anyway, here are the shoes. And looking at them up close, I'm actually super excited about them. They're already all laced up. I wonder how that happened. You know what, I don't actually want this in the frame, so let's... Will that work for you? There we go. Okay, so here are the shoes. Right off the bat, I love the color of them. I love the redness to them. I love, what would you even call it? Kevlar, right? Yeah, I love that Kevlar look. It even has it on that van strip here, which looks amazing. And I love, I love this right here. Like I love that it has these katanas, but I also love the extra detail they put into these shoes. The scratches and all that that it would have on his suit. Even has a little ninja star here. So that's pretty badass. You got the sticker and you got the official licensed Marvel Vans tag there. Pretty cool. Even the laces themselves are super legit. They're actually pretty cool. They're like um, like hollow on the inside. I don't know how to describe that. But this this is actually my favorite part of the laces. Check this out. I don't know if I can get this on camera. It says Marvel on them. How f***ing dope is that? Now that's craftsmanship right there. All right, so here's the outside of the shoe. I'll only look at one and I'll look at the one with the tag on it because both shoes are actually the exact same in every way. Actually, no, the little cuts and, and, and scrapes and stuff on them are a little different. Not by too much. Yeah, so we'll just take a look at one of the shoes since they're both basically the same. Put one off to the side there. I actually like skate highs. Um, I used to actually be a huge fan of the slip-ons, but I, 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 I outgrew those. I don't know, the skate highs, they, they resemble like, they're kind of like little boots in a way. So I think that's why I really love the skate highs. And then on the back of that, you have some more of the little scratches and the katanas and making an X, which I think is super badass. You get the uh, official tag of Vans off the wall there. Here on the inside of the shoe, you have the Ninja Star. Again, you have the strip with the Kevlar print all over that and then right here up on the side of that and then this is what I actually really love it's like a little bullet casing at the at the butt of a bullet yeah it just says Marvel Vans on it but still I think that's really awesome that they put that little detail you know because Deadpool obviously uses guns and other miscellaneous weapons like the katanas and the ninja stars so I think that's pretty badass and then here's the front once again with the tags all right and then the bottom of the shoe I think 
I think it's pretty funny. I, I actually didn't even know what this was, and the more I thought about it, the more I think it's just gum, which is pretty cool. Um, on the other shoe, it has it right there as well, so yeah. You have both gum on that shoe. Cause I don't know, what else would that be? I don't think it would be blood, it's too pink. But um, yeah, comment down below what you think it is. And then here, let's take the laces off of it because I really want to show you all the inside of the shoe. Probably should have left them unlaced. I thought, you know, having them laced up for the video would make them look cooler. But no, no, it doesn't. It's actually a giant nuisance because now I have to undo it. This is what this is what I hate. I like I like think about things, or I don't think about things, I should say, all the way through. And look at, look at, look at all this work I'm having to do. And then now that I'm thinking about it even further, I'm gonna have to put these laces back in. So. Ah, well. All right, so let me just zoom in a little bit. Well, here, I didn't even show you the tongue. The tongue itself has marble bands all over that, and you have this little uh, piece here to put the laces in, and then you still have all the little cuts and stuff on, on the tongue. Yeah, okay, here's the inside of the tongue. Look at that. It has tacos on the inside, and I love that. I didn't even know I had that. Like, the pictures on the website didn't even show them. Having them here in person, I noticed it, and I just fell in love with these shoes even more. So there's that. And then the inside of this shoe, try to get some... Get some light in there. Right, actually, let me grab my phone real quick so I could use the flashlight. Okay, so as you can see, we got the Vans official inside of the shoe logo. Then you got Marvel on top of that, and then you got Deadpool in there, but it's not just a picture of Deadpool. He's actually saying something. Let me try to zoom in so we could all take a read. What are you saying, Deadpool? I gotta show this, man. Damn, this is so much more difficult than I thought it was gonna be. Come on, almost there. There we go. All right, what does that say? Buy this shoe, it's so much better than the other ones. Smiley face, that's awesome. <laughs> Hell yeah. Again, tacos, man. Well, there was the shoes. I hope y'all liked the review. I know it was kind of quick. I really wanted to do like a durability test with them, but I don't know, would y'all? You know, like, just, you know what, screw it. Let's, let's, go, let's go test these babies out outside and see how they, see how they handle, see how they ride. Let me put these on real quick and then we'll head off outside. Well, I don't know how this uh, durability test is gonna go, uh, but it's 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 extra hot today, so we gotta make it quick. Let's see what does Deadpool do? Runs around a lot, so uh, let's start running. All right. Oh man. Deadpool's got to be like super in shape though because I'm already out of breath just by running. I was running just just down this little spot right here. What was that like? Not even 10 feet, but uh, running test uh, did pretty good. Uh, creased them up just a tad, not too much. Yeah, they actually look pretty cool. Creased up a little bit, you know, got some wear and tear on them. Got to figure out what else Deadpool does. What else does he do? Like more parkour, right? So let's get some parkour in this video. Yeah, let's take another sip of water. Don't want to die. We're not actually Deadpool. So, parkour, let's go. Wait, coming down. Hey. X go give it to you. What? Wait for you to get it on your own. X go deliver to you. Knock, knock. Open up the door. It's real. With the non stop pop up and stainless steel. Go hard getting busy with it. But I got such a good heart that I make the mother fun. One day if you get it. Damn right. And I do it again. Cause yeah. I am like so. I got to win. Boy, these shoes are durable. So I break bread with a break. Who you sending me? You mother fun. Never want to know. Nah, just Deadpool. Merc with the mouse. I 
can't die One foot in the grave, but I'm still alive Try to kill me, I'll just revive Then I'll put another bullet right between your eyes I'm dangerous, feeling reckless Popping off caps, leave a trail of guts Sitting on my chair, scratching my nuts Don't stop when I shoot for water was on Yo, grass is grass and I'm on the lawn Hot lead to the head and I won't stop Alright, the durability test went super well. Gotta roll down my windows a little bit. It's a little hot in here. I'll give you my full thoughts on it when I get back to my house. So uh, yeah, let's let's uh, let's head out. Oh, safety first. Alright. Well, there's a durability test for these babies. Uh, uh, I gotta say, they actually held up a, a lot better than I thought. By no means are these actually meant to do the things that I was doing. But if you're like some teenage kid, right? You're like, And you're just at the park and you're just with your friends and you're just climbing all over things. I'd say they would do pretty nice. So, I would actually recommend these shoes. Let me just take them off real quick. <laughs> just want to show y'all how dusty these guys <laughs> Oh, man. Well worth it, I would say. But, I'll just keep them in the box for now. Only because uh, I actually still got the tags on them. I was doing the durability test with the tags on. For the sole purpose of actually just keeping them in the box for now. And so I could actually uh, figure out a place to actually wear them to. I don't know. But for now, I'll just stick with these. Uh, made for the makers. Shoes that I bought a while back. I've had them for months now and they've held up a lot. So... Well guys, that was the review and durability test of Marvel Vans collab shoes, the Deadpool versions. Hope y'all liked this video. Um, I know it was kind of a little, you know, out of the out of the box, I guess, on this channel because I started out doing the toy reviews, but we're gonna get back into the toy reviews and hopefully some movie reviews in the near future. But anyway, that was the review and durability test of these shoes. I'll put the link down below. Uh, hopefully they still have them. I haven't browsed Vans.com in a while since I bought these, so I don't know if they're out of stock or not, but I'll put the link down below to that anyway. So go check them out and check out all the other cool collab that vans have with marvel and i'll see you all in the next video guys all right